Israeli airstrikes on Thursday hit sites in Beirut's southern suburbs, setting explosions between buildings in the area known as Dahia. Israel said it was targeting Hezbollah facilities and interests after issuing evacuation warnings prior to the airstrikes. There were no immediate reports of casualties. On Wednesday, an Israeli airstrike on an apartment building in the town of Aramoun, just south of Beirut, killed at least six people and wounded 15 others, Lebanon's health ministry said. The state-run national news agency reported that there were children missing after the strike and it wasn't clear if they are under the rubble or were transferred to a hospital. There was no warning issued before the strike, and it was not clear what the target was. There was no immediate statement from the Israeli military. Israel has also been striking deeper inside Lebanon since September as it escalates the war against Hezbollah. Israel forces invaded South Lebanon on October 1, causing widespread destruction in border villages but making little advances on the ground inside the country. Israeli forces and the Lebanese militant group Hezbollah have been clashing since October 8, 2023, when Hezbollah began launching rockets across the border in support of its ally, Hamas, in Gaza. The conflict escalated beginning in mid-September. Israel has launched a widespread aerial bombardment of Lebanon and a ground invasion that it said is intended to push Hezbollah back from the border.
The Israeli military on Wednesday struck several sites in Beirut's southern suburbs, an area known as Dahia, after issuing evacuation warnings. It said the strikes were targeting Hezbollah facilities and interests. There were no immediate reports of casualties. Also on Wednesday, an Israeli airstrike on an apartment building in the town of Aramoun, just south of Beirut, killed at least six people and wounded 15 others Wednesday, Lebanon's health ministry said in a statement. The state-run national news agency reported that there were children missing after the strike and, it is not known whether they are under the rubble or were transferred to a hospital in the area. There was no warning issued before the strike, and it was not clear what the target was. There was no immediate statement from the Israeli military. Israeli forces and the Lebanese militant group Hezbollah have been clashing since October 8, 2023, when Hezbollah began launching rockets across the border in support of its ally, Hamas, in Gaza. The conflict escalated beginning in mid-September. Israel has launched a widespread aerial bombardment of Lebanon and a ground invasion that it said is intended to push Hezbollah back from the border. Hello, you can be left for.